I tapped into Caden's spirit of competition. And this boy out here riding this bike, but he's going too fast that I can't release the towel to let him ride on his own. So I got to run with him. And your mama's out of shape. Michael's like, you need exercise. <laughs> so come on out here. So I ain't got to do this too many more times. Kaden, what are you doing? Nothing. Being extra for no reason. Back, Kaya. Thank you, babe. Let mommy out. Come on. Are you coming to get water or something? You want some of mommy's water? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. What? No, I didn't get my water yet. I need a break. Oh, but you know what? I'm outside. So if you got, if you want to go practice while I, I sit here and try, take your bike down there and try to ride it without me. I'm sure you can do it. What's the first rule, Michael? What's the first rule of riding your bike? What's the first rule? No, put him on your his bike. That's crazy, Michael. He can't ride, and the fact that you're on his bike is even crazier. Get off that bike. Don't let people talk you into doing crazy stuff. You gotta master your level before you can go conquer somebody else's. And I'm not limiting your level, I'm just saying, at least get the fundamentals before you just jump on a bike, you can't even touch your feet on the ground. I'm not saying it's not possible. I did put a limitation on my child. I recognize that. So I had to figure out how to walk it back. Dre calls it, I'm changing the goalposts. But in reality, I realized I misstep. So I gotta maneuver around my misstep instead of living in the misstep. I can't be so prideful just to, oh yeah, I put a, lim I put a limitation on my kid. Oh well, no. I gotta walk it back. Don't be too prideful that you leave the chains on your child. I don't know if anybody's caught Caden what balance means. And so he was like, like he got mad at me because I was asking him just like, so I'm supposed to see you failing and just watch you fail for your pride. Yeah. Because you're yelling at Caden to balance. Hey, how about we wait till but, we finish for a bike? But if he doesn't know what balance means, he's never going to balance. So I was just like, does he know how to balance? Does he know what balance means? That's what I said. Does he know what balance means? And then he got frustrated and stopped helping his son because I asked a question. But that's okay, because I was supposed to teach him how to ride a bike. I've taught all four of my babies how to ride a bike. Traumatized that one. <laughs> He's making a burrito. He was horrible at it. And I literally was like talking to the person as we were getting it made, I was like, you want me to tell him to remake it? And I was laughing when I was saying this. So like, I wasn't like trying to blame him, but like, dude, speak now for the whole defeat. You gotta call people out on their mediocrity exactly. because do you think people are truly, that's why people say they're not mediocre. Do you think people are truly trying to be mediocre or this is just the base to the best of their abilities at where they're at? Well, that's why some people sell themselves short. All right, perfect. how about you turn around and try this way since there's no cars moving this way, Kaden? Instead of waiting for him there, try this way. That was probably like me and the chocolate bunnies, him with the Kinder Egg. He probably would save them for himself. You gonna keep, you gonna try on the pedals? Okay, right. Push off. Remember the neighbor's trying to leave. So you gotta pay attention to that. All right, let's go. Tell her where you wanted to go. Let's start this watch your feet okay right. well you watch your feet him pay attention to yeah, in front of you no you're okay, good but i just want to make sure that you're uh... no a non-partial person which means somebody who's not involved can do the countdown so okay bailey, one two three go when bailey says one two three go we go we're going to the speed bump 
One, two, three, go.